Play pretty like a girl And he got five stories to tell I see both sides like Please, can't you tell me what and I am selling right now the, the Nikon camera this bad boy right here with the chargers, a cable and some accessories that came on the box basically you have the manuals, a disc, more plastics and also this to pack the camera so I am selling it right now and I have a little of mids emotions you know for this camera and it has been a good friend to make the, the first video and right now we will see how the newer videos are, are getting right now but because the person that is gonna buy it it's coming right now like on some minutes I have to package this thing this is the model if you if you wonder uh, well I will be missing it a little bit but not because of the, of the video because the video on this camera was very awful especially the, the, the autofocus which is cross compatible with Mac computers as well as PCs you can So I have just sell the camera, the Nikon camera, and I have like mixed feelings. Basically because when I grab for the last time that camera, it came to me a lot of memories when I was filming these videos for the first time, when I was like trying new angles, all the photos I have taken with that camera. And the first time I see it, like on C19 when all of this was getting crazy and I grabbed that camera basically because I was curious about that and yeah it's it has been a little hard to to let that camera away but but I had to do it in order to buy this camera you know I didn't like some things about that camera for example the autofocus very I am very sure that you have seen that guys when I was filming and the camera like Threw the whole thing out and it was very bad for the videos and a lot of people have been saying that to me um, but I think that upgrade to this camera it's very helpful I don't think it's necessary um, in my opinion but I think it really helps with filming these videos I've filming a lot during these past two months on the university but to, to all the exams and the uh, work I have to do on the exam because I am on like seven courses, seven heavy courses um, for a project and a plan I've been working on for the last years. Um, and as you see guys on the last videos of the last clips, when my family arrived to the country and I have to pass the most time I can have with them so due to all of that my grades have been lower and all I basically couldn't edit a single video on the last month so sorry guys for that but I've been filming a lot with this camera with the iPhone and 
also with the old camera I have just found, the Sony Handycam. Well, I hope that on this week I could like edit something on the week that it's coming. And well, it's right now 6 and 26 p.m. 5 October 2024. So, well, I will be studying and practicing right now my book for contability that it's a course that I am having apart from the other ones on the university obviously and well I have until today to to do that and well that's it also I wanted to say to you guys that we reach the 2000 subscribers I have seen it like on the past week I am very grateful for that guys and well I have some mixed emotions with that camera half been sold and well let's use this new it's a new camera I didn't remember that I have been saying to you guys that I have get a new camera it's basically this one it's a Sony camera and well I am keeping the, the tripod the Nikon tripod because it's very good uh, honestly like I didn't have see any tripod doing this work um, and well I am very used to it so I will be keeping it and well let's get this done for today thank you for everything guys I hope this is the end of the vlog see you guys in the next one Okay, so it's um, tomorrow, well, um, 23 of October, and it's basically the, the next day that yesterday I filmed the video that you saw, and I had classes basically 13 hours by the day, and the project is almost finished, the podcast. Um, I also publish on, on LinkedIn a post about exactly this. I will show you how the video is going. Okay, so this is the, the current plan. And this is how it's going. Yeah, you can see the, the subtitles, the effects, the zoom. Um, the colors are very good on on this Sony camera that you have me. Um, and well, this is the the intro. You have there my friends. Okay, so. Basically, this video is like an hour long and it's almost finished. I only have to finish the intro that it already has a song that it's the, the Oppenheimer one, <laughs> one of the soundtrack from the Oppenheimer movie. And you have here a drop the intro and I have to do like some transitions, video transitions. Oh. Some video transitions and sound effects for the subtitles and check if and check if there is any details I have to to correct. Basically for the video to be finished and upload it to to YouTube to my teachers got to see it or I will do like a file I don't know but I have to export it right now and check the details and 
do the, the things I have just told you. It's now it's now nine and forty two PM and I have to have it by twelve. So we have like two hours and a half, two hours and fifty minutes to export a video, do um, some corrections, details, transitions, and upload to YouTube and etc. So I have to hurry up to get this thing done. And unfortunately, I had to do this video on my classes that I have classes like 13 hours, like I have just said to you. I had in total like four classes from different courses and I don't feel good for that. And, and there was so many courses that I was very interested about the topics that they were teaching, but I unfortunately didn't have the opportunity to, to pay attention to that because I was editing this video and I have to get it done today. And while well, I want to this video to be to be good, I have never done a podcast before and this podcast has a very good um, percentage and weight of the final grade for the course. And uh, well, let's finish it. So it's almost done, 99%. Please, 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 please. please. Let's go. Okay, let's see. 16 gigabytes. Let's go. Okay. okay, so it's ready, the video is live on YouTube, basically to only my class can see it, and uh, well, the job is done for today, tomorrow I have a, an appointment for my shoulder because I don't know if I already tell you, but I have like a injury on my shoulder, basically because whenever I do a push exercise like on the pegs, on the chest, basically, um, I hit like this one fiber right here. And I think it's a nerve because I feel like on my neck all around here and it's very strong, the pain. And I don't think it's the upper pecs, like there is no way. And I have this pain since January of this year. So tomorrow I will check what is happening with that. Also, because I have like six exams on the next week, I have to study for all of that. And while well, I have an statistics exam, um, discrete structures, physics, uh, computer, architecture exam I have one exam more so it's like to four to five uh, days in a row that I have some exams and then I have to study for calculus so I have very busy weeks right now and well that's it for today it's currently 11 and 55 54 p.m. It's very late for me. I don't usually go to sleep at this hour, but well, 
let's hold the bar for the next day. Also, I wanted to say that the video got very good. I, I must say, I am very proud of the result. And well, I hope my teacher really likes the video. Um, it's like an hour long, like I said. And well, bye bye. Terminé la universidad a los 23 años, me casé a los 24 años y a los 25 años era papá. ¿Usted qué opina de que se aprende más en el trabajo, o sea, en el campo, que la teoría que te enseña la universidad? Era otra época. Una época donde los jóvenes salíamos a trabajar porque nuestros padres no nos podían pagar la universidad. Y, y es la verdad, yo creo que la universidad es como Dios. No se nota cuando lo tienes, pero sí se percibe cuando hay ausencia. Las habilidades blandas es lo que más nos diferencia. Y yo tenía un despertador que sonaba cuando, para avisarme que ya debería regresar a mi casa porque yo era tarde. ¿Cuáles serían las cinco cosas que le diría a su yo de 19 años?